Thanks for watching my video today. Let's discuss our reduction formula here. Integration of cos to the power mx, mx, cos and x dx. Okay. So here our integral involve m and n. So let's score this integral to be i m n. Okay. Which is integration of cos mx cos and x dx so now now we are going to use integration by part treating yes mm, cos and x as our second function okay meaning cos mx is our first function okay so integration by part first function into integration of second function minus integration differentiation of this one let's try out d by dx of cos mx into integration of cos and x dx okay this is our integration by part now integration of cos is what sine right sine and x but here n involved so multiply in the so I write down in the denominator minus integration differentiation of cos mx is m cos m minus 1x and differentiation of cos is minus sin x and integration of cos is sin and x over n dx okay this is cos mx into sin and x over n minus taking uh, this and this become plus so m and n since they are constant so taking out this one cos m minus 1 x sine and x into sine x dx so since we have sine and x and sine x this one we can now let's consider let's look a uh, close relation for this so in trigo trigonometry we have cos and minus 1 x is cos and x cos x plus sine and x sine x okay so applying cos a minus b formula you will get this so or i m n is turn out to be plus m over n integration of cos m minus 1 x sine n x sine x in place of this we can write this here this one there transfer here you get cos and minus 1 x minus this transfer here minus cos and x into cos x dx okay this continue here now you get cos mx sin and x over n plus m over n integration of cos m minus 1 x cos n minus 1 x dx breaking up okay plus minus minus m over n integration of cos m minus 1 x into this one is 
okay let's try out cos and minus on x cos and x cos x dx so which is cos and minus on x sin and x over n plus m over n cos and minus on x cos and minus on x dx minus m over n integration of cos m minus 1 x and cos x is what well, cos m x into cos and x dx and what is this what is this actually this is our original integral okay this one so this whole term is nothing but or i of mn okay now let, let me write down here so what do we have i of mn is equal to cos m minus 1 x sin n x over n cos m minus 1 x sin n x over n plus m over n integration of cos m minus 1 x cos m minus 1 x dx um, minus m over n i of mn okay which is this one so here we have to so transfer here you get i m n 1 plus m over n right which is cos m minus 1 x sin n x over n plus m over n integration of cos m minus 1 x cos n minus 1 x dx why i don't integ integrate this one because this one if you integrate again same thing here okay same process you will follow so what do we get i m n m plus n over n equal to cos m minus 1 x sin n x over n plus m over n integration of cos m minus 1 x cos n minus 1 x dx so n n will cancel out so lastly you get i m n is cos m minus 1 x sin n x over this m plus n coming down here m plus n plus m over m plus n integration of cos m minus 1 x cos n minus 1 x dx so this is our reduction formula for this particular integral so let's write down integration of cos mx cos nx dx is equal to cos m minus 1 x sine of nx over m plus n plus m over m plus n integration of cos m minus 1 x cos n minus 1 x dx so this is our reduction formula okay thanks for watching